Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to the StockSwoosh.com Play of the Day. This is Marvell. Today is June 5th, and it was a nice gap here. I really did like this today. It actually worked out much better than expected, uh, and this is not a gap on earnings. You know, every once in a while, you get a good gap um, that's not on earnings. I forget the reason for this gap, actually, but I liked the gap. It was definitely gapping. I rated the gap. It rated per my system, so I decided to do it. You know, it's one of these things where you have to look at every single solitary stock individually, okay? Whatever the reason for the gap is, it could be any one of a million things. Stocks can gap because the CEO quits. It can gap for a downgrade. It can gap for earnings. Uh, it can gap for some kind of news gap. Uh, it could gap for so many different reasons. And, you know, I just check to see if it's gapping. I mean, that's really what I do, and then I rate it. So here we have Marvell. This did not go to the dream target today. It really would have been a stretch for this to go to the dream target today. Dream target in this really would have been 1480. And this could have gone there today, but that was not realistic. I didn't feel uh, the market is extremely bullish today. And I mean, this really, if it really wanted to rock and roll, could have come all the way down here. But again, very unlikely given the market's movement today. So this had a nice movement today for the stock. It usually moves 40, 50, 60 cents in any given day. And that's exactly what it moved here today and uh, had a nice trade in it, even had an ad. And you could have even been aggressive on this. I'm all out of this now, but the trade was in the morning, which I like to do, and it had the momentum and the volatility in the morning. So let's just find it here. Okay. So Marvell. Opened, came in, rallied, set up again, dropped. And really, 15, 17, 15, 16, 15, 15 was the first target. So the stock went down into the first target in the first half an hour of the day, which is, is normal, actually. It's usual for a stock to go to at least one of the targets within the first 15 to 30 minutes. That's exactly what this did. Came all the way down and then broke a new low and came down almost to $15. And actually, this lasted till 11 o'clock. So I had a nice, nice movement in here. You really could have loaded up on this, actually. Even could have added back in here if you wanted to, although it really didn't have that far to go down here to the next target, unless it would have gone to 14-something. I did not think that was likely today, though, given the market. But a very, very nice gap, nonetheless, in Marvell. Uh, it is not earnings season right now. However, there are earnings out every day. You look for the gaps, regardless of the reason. You have to look for gaps and find them and qualify them every morning. And particularly in non-earnings season, when there are less stocks gapping, you have to be very specific to qualify things to make sure you get something good. Now, you know, you get gaps in any, all throughout the year, January through December. You get gaps every day, but you do have to be picky because if you have less things to look at, you want to make sure you're doing something that's good, not just for the sake of doing something. And I think that's extremely important. But, you know, it's the flip side, whereas if it's earnings season, you want to do every single gap that's out there, you still can't do that. You have to qualify them and do the ones that are good. So very nice movement in Marvell here today. Happy to get something here nice on a Thursday that works so smoothly. Love to take a trade and be up as soon as I take it. Love to take a trade and just have it right on down. Didn't even have to babysit this. Wasn't concerned with it at all. Nice trade. Had a high level of conviction in doing this today and just really felt like it would work, and it did. This is Melissa with the StockSwish.com. If you're interested in more information on the upcoming Golden Gap class, it's this weekend, June 7th and 8th. June is the last month to do the class at the current price of $24.99. The class price will be increasing as of July 1st to $29.99. So for those of you that are interested in doing the class, uh, you can email me and sign up as late as uh, June 6th by 5 o'clock Eastern Time. Email me at melissa at thestockswish.com if you'd like more information. Thanks, everybody. Have a great day.